Hi guys, this is Ober from Cytron Technologies. Today, I'd like to use a Raspberry Pi 0W connect to a Raspberry Pi HQ camera or high quality camera with a 6mm lens to take a close up picture of any product that you like. I'll be using a Raspberry Pi 4 Model B as the target product and I'll be sharing more pictures at the back of this video. Do remember to change the FFC cable for the Pi Zero. I'll be using VNC to log in, so let's check it out. Now, I'm into Raspberry Pi Zero W through the VNC. First thing, go to Menu and Raspberry Pi Configuration. We need to enable the camera interface from here. Go to the Interface tab you notice the first one is camera, enable it, then click OK. It requests you to reboot, just reboot it. Now I'm back to Raspberry Pi Zero Raspbian after it reboot. First thing we need to test is whether the camera is working. To do that, open up a terminal window, put in this command, the negative T0 means it will display a preview window constantly until we press Ctrl C key. And the rest of the command is just to adjust the window resolution and also position of the preview. Press enter. So this is the preview that I get. I think this is due to low light. I'll bring up the actual setup video together with this screen. So the first thing I will do is to adjust the aperture. Now you need to loosen the small screw on the aperture ring. Hold the first ring. Adjust the aperture ring using the small screw until there is sufficient light go into the camera. And if you are satisfied, lock the small screw of the aperture ring. Let me adjust the board so that we can, you know, look at the whole board in one picture. Well, now I will adjust the focus point. Now loosen the small screw of the focus ring. Adjust the aperture ring together with the front ring until you are satisfied with the focus point. Now you can adjust the aperture and the focus as many times as you like. I will fast forward the following step. So to cancel the preview, just press Ctrl C. Now let's take an actual photo and save it on desktop. Just put in this command it will display preview for 5 seconds and it will save the file. Let's check out the file from the desktop. So this is the file and let's look at the size. So it's quite big and this is the actual file. I'll share this at the back of this video and you can also take video using this command. So again, you display five seconds. I will show some movement. Then if have saved the file again is on the desktop. So this is the file. Let's open it and have a look. I'll save all this file in a Google Drive. I'll share the drive link under this video. So here are some of the photo that I took. So this is the first photo that we took in this video. And this is the setup. I have also adjust the Raspberry Pi 4 B board to take more photo. This is the CPU IC and also the RAM IC. This is the Ethernet controller and also USB controller. I also swapped the product to Maker P hat. This is the back of Maker P hat, and also some of the buttons on Maker P hat. I also taken the Raspberry Pi 
SD card adapter and I also taken the Raspberry Pi Zero itself so I also notice if you block some of the light the IC marking is clearer so that's all for me in this video as always thanks for watching and if you like the video please give it a thumb up see you in next video bye Thank you.